After testing out so many different workouts that other people have tried for their successful fitness journeys all over YouTube, I wanted to test and find out which ones would give the best results for me. Here are the workouts that catapulted me to my successful thigh slimming and overall weight loss journey. Hello Daily Student family, welcome back to another video. I hope you're all doing well, I hope you're all doing good and if you're new here, hello my name's Kimberly and I hope you subscribe. Turn your bell notifications on so you get notified every single time that I upload and give this video a massive thumbs up. Now as you guys can tell from the title of today's video, I'm going to be going through all the exercises and the ways that I lost £27 in one month. Now guys, I had been struggling to lose weight for all of my entire life. In high school I was the biggest friend and I genetically thought it wasn't possible. I wanted to wear shorts but the thigh rub would never allow me to and um, it was just so uncomfortable and the idea of wearing crop tops terrified me. I wasn't happy with how much I was eating and my lack of being able to exercise and I wanted to finally try something that was successful. I tried everything under the sun, like all the workouts possible, I have tried them. I'm so excited to give to you guys the ones that really really worked for me. Now don't forget to come over and follow my inspirational fitness page on Instagram as well as my podcast page as well. Now you guys know for the longest time I battled with losing five pounds, gaining it back, losing 20 pounds, gaining it back. Nothing ever stuck, nothing ever worked. And I finally broke that cycle, case closed, and it was automatically um, something that I got on lock that really, really worked and helped me. Like I say, I really thought it was genetic and not even possible for my body to go from this to this. I really want to break down to you all the workouts that I did that changed my life forever. I'll also be going into the Glow With Joe workouts and the ones that really took me to places that I've never been before. Places that I didn't think were possible. Now without further ado, let's get into the workouts. Also guys, don't forget to give this video a massive thumbs up if you would like to see me completely film an updated workout routine to take you through how I lose weight in a typical week and the best workouts and what they sort of look like. Now the first video, so like I said to you guys, I'd never worn a crop top before. I struggled with not being able to exercise that belly fat off and really get my belly and uh, stomach area shrunk down to an hourglassy ab figure. Now this video, that I'm going to show you guys is insane. I finally wore crop tops. Having my belly out as my every single day attire was something I didn't think was possible but this workout really really got me there. When I tell you this will burn like crazy I'm sweating right now just thinking about how much it burns. It's one of the most popular ab workouts on the entirety of YouTube. And I've told you before that Pamela Rife catastrophically changed my entire physique and journey because her workouts are insanely hard. I mean I've seen so many people will do before and after videos of Pamela's ab workouts and hers are one of the most top rated for transformation. I know there are some ab workouts where I do them and I start to look a little bit square. I'm not sure if you guys have had that but it was a really big issue for me. I wanted to just alleviate that completely and get my hourglass ab figure and this is the video for that. I would suggest, highly suggest doing this alongside walking. I will go into my favourite Glow With Joe walking video a little bit later on in the video and explain to you why that is a complete game changer. Specifically in the Pamela video is insane. I come from a CrossFit background like you guys know and I know which movements are going to catapult you so close to your end goal in less time. You want to be doing less for more. Essentially if you do an hour of the wrong workout that will take you ages to get to your goal but 15 minutes half an hour of the correct workout will get you so much close to your goal in less time and that's what you really really want to focus on which workouts are doing the right movements and it's exactly one like this. So add this into your routine. I cannot emphasize how much it changed my entire journey for me. The next workout I did was in fact a thigh workout. Thigh rub was the, you know, I, I it was so hard for me because I just wanted to wear shorts and cute dresses. I'd never been there before and even through high school I was just the person who'd always wear leggings and trousers. It just would not work for me. Summer coming up, all of these things, wearing summer dresses, it just did not work. And I kid you not, this thigh video was absolutely fantastic for my entire entire results. The fact that this is called lazy girl thigh workouts is incredible. When I first started out I didn't have the push or motivation. I struggled to find push and motivation throughout my journey especially when it came to thighs because they're just a lot heavier, a lot stumpier. It's harder for me to get up and want to do a thigh workout. The fact that this is labeled lazy girl workouts it will still burn. We're doing them lying down. I would do these when lying in bed and the fact that it was just giving me such a huge difference in a week week alone. Like I say, within the first week I'd lost nine pounds and I've never been more proud and more, I like 
seeing physical and real results because that was what propels me and motivates me to the next day waking up and thinking, right, we're going harder again today, we're going harder tomorrow, we're going harder tomorrow. And this workout will really take you to the next level and you can lie down to ease yourself into a routine because I kid you not, by week two, if you stay consistent for two weeks, by week two, you will, your body will crave working out and that's what I really wanted to work towards getting to. And this workout will give you exactly that. My thighs were burning. I was struggling to go up the stairs. It is so, so good. And again, this is one of the most popular thigh work workouts in the whole of YouTube. I wanted to see results and ones that worked. This movement in particular is absolutely fantastic. It's going to give you a crazy burn that you have never felt before, but it is so worth it. It will burn. It You will sweat. The fat feels like it's crying, although fat doesn't cry. It will feel like it because you will have sweat in places you have never sweated before. But that's why it works so fantastically well. And I kid you not, my legs shrunk down so, so quickly. And I cannot be more proud of this entire video at all. The next workout video is this one. Now, again, it's another thigh video, but the reason why I like this one as well is again because it's a Pamela thigh. The reasons why I emphasize these videos so much is because there are before and after videos of Pamela doing the workouts and I was searching them, researching which ones are the best. So I saw those and I was like, what? People's results are insane. And when I did it for myself, I kid you not, within a week of doing her videos, the differences were crazy. I bought a pair of shorts initially and I wanted to measure up against how they would end up fitting, like my dream shorts. It was good motivation. I got them from Zara. Zara sizes run quite small, but I bought them anyway because they have the design that I really, really wanted to try and wear. And I kid you not, week after week, they were fitting more and more to the point where they came became too big. They are too big for me. And this is videos like this with Pamela. She will push you to places you've never been before. This movement, in the, alongside the sequence that she puts them in is for ultimate fat burning, ultimate calorie pump, muscle workout. Remember, muscle mass burns fat and she will give you that exact push and pump that you need to get there. Consistency is key, but she gives you less for more. You're going to be burning, pushing, sweating, crying for more. I have been there. It burned like crazy, but I love her videos and I continue to do them till this day. I just remember so categorically that this one was the one that repelled me so much where I saw heavy differences. People were complimenting my differences. I love Pamela's video for that reason. The next video is a walk the weight off glow with Joe. Now guys, you know how walking transformed me. I did a walking, everyday walking where I updated you guys on my walking every single day and how much it really pushes the fat. If you think about it in the gym or doing the workouts, you're building the muscle mass and then you're walk you're pushing off the fat, you're pushing off the weight essentially in a non-scientific way. You're pushing off, it really does catapult you and speed up so much faster if you add walking. You know, we've seen so many people emphasizing the importance of walking, but I kid you not, when I add walking to a week of exercising and doing the home workout, um, I will, I, I can lose up to, you know, four to three to four pounds more just by doing the walking. Not only are you shredding off the water weight, but you're also building up that stamina for your body to continue doing the walking to get the results faster as well. Now, this Glow With Joe video is absolutely incredible. I mean, sweat Sweating buckets is an understatement because I was sweating so much that I, I just didn't know what to do with myself, but I kept going. They're short, they're sweet, they're motivating, they will push you, and they are so, so handy if you really want something extra to make sure you're working to your results. What can be tricky sometimes for me is staying stagnant, feeling those weeks where I haven't felt a change, I haven't felt anything, and this time around what was so different is I had so many less of those moments. My results kept coming, kept coming, kept coming, kept coming. It was continuous, and this video is phenomenal to keep you on track. For me, it kept me so on track. I still saw the results more and more every single time. This video is crucial. Add this in about three, maybe four times a week if you're feeling a bit crazy. But yes, it's absolutely fantastic and it will catapult and push you close to your goal a lot faster. Now, last but not least, I have to add in my full body workout. Now, this is so important to add at some point in the week. The reason for this is you don't want to be working out the same area every single time because your body needs that reset. Like I was recently talking about, this workout specifically will push you to places you've never been before. It's working out everything. You want to keep your body surprised because that's what allows the results to keep coming. When it feels stagnant, you're doing too much of the same thing. I saw so much difference in adding this full body workout. You're doing more HIIT training. It's higher intensity. You're, you're breathing, you're pushing even more. Every part of your body is shaking, it's jiggling, it's getting the fat off, and this is what really helped me. The combination of the cardio and the muscle training is so important because you really want to have a mixture 
mixture of both. Your body works best with fat burning and calorie burning when you have a mixture of both. The results are a lot faster. I really, really noticed this for myself. And I think it was the huge catalyst to a really, really good period of time where I got heavy, heavy, heavy results. Now guys, if you have enjoyed this video, don't forget to give it a massive thumbs up if you would like to see an updated workout routine film. But also don't forget to come over and follow my inspirational fitness page on Instagram as well as my podcast page as well. Don't forget I always emphasize that food, food, food is so important because you don't want to be doing all this work just to be eating it back as you go along. Therefore, you're going to see no results. Even if you have to start off small, start at your own pace and work back down that way. There are no limits to what you have to eat as long as you eat in moderation. Know how much sugar your body can take. Know how much sugar makes you tired. Know how much sugar is enough to give you a treat but give you energy. Know how much of each thing is so important. Keep your protein up. Do eat carbohydrates because carbohydrates keep you full. Keep your full balance. Your food is your holy grail to the success of everything. So make sure it's the right foods. Now I love you guys so, so much. I'm so excited to hear about your results in the comments. And I'll speak to you guys very, very soon. Bye guys.